Chris was a very, very giving man. Giving man. Um, I mean, he'd do anything for you. He always talked about making the apartment downstairs. It was a slow process, but it was definitely one, you know, we were looking forward to, we were all looking forward to. And um, the night before he passed, he was downstairs tiling. We tried really hard to get it done as quickly as possible. And, um, you know. And so we're left with his friends that, in, that, that come out and help us now when we need it. They, they did as much as they could possibly do. I mean, but there were things that weren't completely done. When Linda told me about the Iron Man and what the church would like to do, I was like, we can't, we can't have people do that for us. The, the list is, was almost never ending. When we came up in the driveway, the army of men that were out here was unbelievable. They're, they're great men, great men. I feel like um, they're a band of angels that unearth. The way they came in here and did what they did was amazing. I mean, it, it feels like a completely different home. It feels like home and it feels completed, you know, to where we do feel safe. They definitely made us feel safe. I felt excited. I finally felt excited. I hadn't felt excited in a while. I really, you know, I don't know a lot of, um, you know, faces in, in the church, um, but I definitely have at least 15 that I could run up to and give a hug. And, 